Hello everyone, my name is Lisa Fishman. For those of you who don't know me, I'm a singer, I'm a songwriter, I'm an actor, I'm a voiceover artist. Most recently, I got to play Bobit Seitel, AKA Grandma Seitel, in the hit off-Broadway production of Fiddler on the Roof in Yiddish, directed by the one and only Joel Gray. So I got to play a Bobby, which is the Yiddish word for a grandmother, a little Jewish grandmother, in this production, eight shows a week, in New York, but never before did I get to play a bubby, a little Jewish grandmother in a dancing plush toy. Anyhow, I have been so excited to share this with you. Bubby just arrived. Oy, she took weeks and weeks and months to arrive from the old country. She came with only a bag, a few pennies in her pockets, and she is finally here. And I want to share with you, I got to do the voices for this Yiddish Bubby. Without further ado, before I tell you anything else about her, let's have you get a little listen to my Yiddish Bubby. <laughs> So that was a good one. That was both in Yiddish and in English. She said, Bistu Meshuggah, which means, of course, are you crazy? So this little doll not only has Yiddish and English expressions, but also plays music. And as it says, it's a dancing plush toy. She does dance. Let's see if this next one, what comes up. I'm sure you all, if you've been to a Simcha, to a Jewish celebration, you know this one. And it's amazing, she's not falling down, not using her walker. You're quite a good dancer, Bobby, I'm impressed. Okay, Bobby, Bobby. See, yes, that now I'm singing in Hebrew right now, not in Yiddish. But there are songs on here, traditional melodies that you would recognize in Hebrew, in Yiddish, traditional klezmer music featuring clarinet and violin. So some of the expressions, these one-liners, these hilarious one-liners that you would recognize that maybe your own Bubby said are in this little doll. Um, I think there's probably more than 20 different expressions. I've listened to this over and over, over. I mean, of course, I am the one who recorded the voices, but sometimes I don't remember exactly what I did. Here's another one. Never, Grandma. I'm sorry. That, that ship has sailed. <laughs> you know this one? Hava, Nagila, Hava, Nagila. Now, if you wanted her to stop early on some of the dancing, you can just grab her and do that. Let's hear another expression or two. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. I mean, what is more familiar than a Jewish grandmother saying ay, ay, ay? What's next, Bubby? Chazer, a pig. What else, Bubby? Azoi, get let's go. So anyhow, this Bubby, one more Bubby, one more. You look hungry, Zitz. Bubby just made a fresh pot of matzo balls and knedla. Ay, Bubby, I'm not hungry. Trust me, I eat. So this Bubby, again, which is called... My Yiddish Bubby, my Yiddish Bubby, has all these incredible expressions, both in English and in Yiddish. Uh, there's a little description on the inside about Ellie Kay, who created this incredible doll. And um, by the way, thank you, Ellie, and a little special shout out and thank you to Rachel Zetkoff Kessler, a new mamala, a Yiddish mama who was so gracious to connect Ellie with me and who I worked with to do these voices, these Yiddish voices for the Bubby doll. Um, a couple other things I wanna say about Bubby. So the, some of the one-liners have music, some don't, it's traditional klezmer music. Yiddish melodies you would recognize, as you heard, Hebrew melodies. She also is wearing this lovely apron. And if you hadn't noticed, I'm wearing the same apron because you can also, and I'm going to tell you in a minute where you can get this all, there's a separate kit that you can get 
it's sort of for Hanukkah, but she, of course, can, and by the way, I have to look next time and see how many shopping days till Hanukkah. She's, of course, a great gift for Hanukkah, but anyhow, there's a kit that you can get with this human-sized apron with lovely expressions like Chag Sameach, which means Happy Holidays, with a Hanukkah, which of course is the special candelabra for Hanukkah. And it also comes with um, little cookie cutters in Hanukkah shaped, Hanukkah theme shaped cutters. Did I say that right? Um, and a little donut mold to make the little donuts for Hanukkah. All this, by the way, can be found right now, the only place, hopefully they're, they're, it's going to be at other places as well, but right now only online at Bed, Bath, and Beyond. So her name is My Yiddish Bubby. And if you see the spelling, because Bubby is traditionally, it's a, it's a Yiddish word, which was written in Hebrew letters, there's different ways to transliterate it. But here it's spelled B-U-B-B-I-E, My Yiddish Bubby. So if you type in, go to Bed Bath & Beyond and type in My Yiddish Bubby, you will find her. And then you can also find the little kit that has the adult size apron. It's really, f and it has a little hat, I believe. Great for working with kids for the holidays. Um, what else do I want to say? I just hope you love her as much as I do. I have to say I'm kvelling, which means I'm bursting with pride. I wish... My own bubbies could see this. Uh, I know they and my mom would just be tickled, tickled to death. They'd be plotsing. They'd be exploding with joy. So anyhow, Bubby and I will be making some more appearances, but I just wanted to introduce her right now and say, I'm going to have to find out how many shopping days till Hanukkah. It's never too soon. Right, Bubby? What? The ganze is coming. The ganze is coming. The whole family. All right, everybody. Bubby and I will see you later. Signing off. Oi, did you meet my son, the genius? He is more in his head than in his pockets. Oh, if I were a rich man. From Fiddler on the Roof. A be gesund, everyone. You should only be healthy. Yep, bye, 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 bye,